Well, hello everybody. I'm back. Um, I got a lot of people that said, yeah, they wanted to see what I bought when I went shopping. So, I'm going to show y'all. Might be a long haul, so y'all settle back and get y'all something to eat. But, um... Oh, shoot. I'm uh, fiddling with this necklace. I was going to show y'all, um... Recap on some of the jewelry that uh, my sweet subscriber, um, MC Jewelry, made for me. And uh, she sent me a, a beautiful set this time. And it's a really special one. And I'll share it with y'all. I want y'all to see it. It's pretty amazing what she done. And I uh, wanted to show y'all just recap on some of the stuff that she sent me before. I'm going to... Put down in my description box um, uh, how you can get a hold of her. Now, I don't know. It might be too late for Christmas. But um, I'm going to list. I'm gonna put it down below anyway. And y'all can contact her or whatever and see, you know, if you got time for Christmas. But, boy, it'd be wonderful Christmas gifts. I should have got on here whenever she sent it. And um, showed it right away and gave her information so y'all could order if y'all wanted to order for Christmas. But I'm sorry that I didn't. I've had a lot of things going on and just slipped my mind and I wasn't thinking about it. But um, anyways, I, let me just show y'all. Oh, I didn't say hi. My name is Diane. And I've got a haul for y'all tonight. And it's just... Um, Stuff that I went shopping for, it's stuff from Walgreens, from Walmart, uh, the Dollar Tree, the General Dollar. I don't know if I have anything from the Family Dollar. I might. I got uh, three big old bags over there, and today I went shopping again, but all I did was buy some, some cards for some people that I wanted to get sent off. And, um, uh, some more boxes and some wrapping paper and stuff like that. But I got, went to, uh, UPS and sent off a package. So they said, yes, it would be there by Friday. Friday, they said. So I really hope that it gets there by Friday because I'm sending it to somebody special and I hope she gets it before Christmas. And um, I went and sent off uh, some Christmas cards to um, some of my YouTube family, uh, my YouTube friends on here. And um, I was going to give a shout out to uh, Menopause and Madness, April Rain. Um, she watches me, and, uh, I don't know if y'all watch her or not, but she's great, guys. I just, she has that soothing voice, and I could just sit and listen to her all night. I love, love her channel. And, um, if y'all haven't, y'all, um, go over there and, and check her out. I'll try my best to link her deal down below in my description box. Um, so it'd be easier for you to get to if I can figure it out. But it's Menopause and Madness, April Rain. And uh, she does this real cute thing where she's, uh, she, I can't do it. I can't do it. I'm just, I don't have it in me to do it like this. She, she goes, welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> and it's so cute. I love it. I love the way she does that. But, um, April, if you are listening to me right now, or whenever you see this video, I um, am trying to send you a Christmas card for your Christmas card uh, decoration deal that you got. But I can't find, um your friend mail so if you're seeing me and you're watching this can you either contact Laura or um, 
hey everybody get with them they have my contact information and i'd like to connect with you so i can get that sent off and sent to you and i hope that you get it by christmas so um if you're listening to me uh get with me and my email my email is down um below in my stuff so you can get to my email if you want to contact me that way so anyway she's super super sweet guys y'all need to go watch her if y'all haven't watched her because y'all really enjoy her so anyway let's get to this um i have some stuff from mc jewelry that i want to show y'all that she sent me and uh let me find my glasses put my glasses on real fast I wanted to show y'all this again I think I have already shown y'all this but I'm gonna show you again um, this this necklace that she made for me it's uh I got it I got it turned backwards of course I do but it's this one with the pink and the little really pretty stone there that shines so well look at that look how she twists that up to look like a rose that amazes me i mean it really does in all of her jewelry she puts this special little um this you know her little initial deals there and here is the earrings that she made to go with that it it's so nice like the material that she uses and the stones, they're just, they're just so beautiful. I mean, it's such craftsmanship. I can't believe how, I wish I was talented like this. I don't have this in a bone in my body that has anything that can do this. But look at that, guys. I mean, that is just something. So that's something that she had sent me. And this is one of them that she sent me the first time that she sent it. That I love it so much. I have worn the fire out of this thing. But that's one that she sent me. And then she sent me the pink colored one that's a little bit bigger. But I'll show you what she sent me this time. She always sends my girls something. She always makes them something special and sends it. And she's just so sweet. Uh, it's kind of twisted up. Let me fix it. Still battling with this old stuffy nose. My husband, of course, wants to ship me off to the hospital every time I get any kind of anything. I'm trying to fix it, guys. So y'all can see it. I'll show y'all in the case that she sent it. Can y'all see that? Can y'all see what it says? Let me see if I can do it a different way. You can see it may be better if I... <coughs> Excuse me. Stop moving. I don't know. Y'all might see it better the other way. But it says Mimi. <laughs> Isn't that cute? Oh, I love it so much. Let's see if I hold it up like this. See, it says Mimi. And she got little stones and stuff right there. And then the earrings, of course, are beautiful. That goes along with it. Isn't that cute? I mean, look how she did that. And then right here in the corner, it's got a little stone in there that, that shines. If y'all can't see it. And then right here on the end, she's got some little beads that hang off. It's just, it's so beautiful. So beautiful. She just, every time she sends me stuff, it amazes me even more how talented she is. She sent me some, some earrings. Let me take them. <clears throat> Let me take them out of the package. Of course, I don't have my scissors. It's got those little things on the end if I can get them. 
to work for me. Or I can just open it up. Of course it's not going to work for me. There you go, I got it. Here we go. I thought I like this little thing that she made it on. But look at those. Aren't those pretty? And she said on her deal, she said that she was sending me the earrings and that I could uh, gift them or give them away or what have you. And I was like, oh no, I'm keeping those. I mean, these are just gorgeous, gorgeous earrings. Like the stones in them, how she did the stones and you know, how she did all of this work. Look at all that work that she put into it. They're just beautiful. Show this other pair that she sent. But I'm going to put her information down below. She's not, she's not expensive, guys. It's not going to be no Timu prices, but you're not going to get Timu quality either. These are amazing. And here's the other pair. Those little, these little paper deals that she's got are so cute. Stop moving. But aren't those cute? They're so cute. I don't know if y'all can really see. Maybe if I put my hand right here. See the stones that are in there that she put? I know you're not seeing it very well. Kind of a smoky, kind of a smoky color stone. But they're just gorgeous. <coughs> and if you're watching me tonight, thank you, thank you. I can't tell you and um, how excited I get every time I get anything from you in the mail. It's just, and I'm just amazed at the craftsmanship. It's just unbelievable. So, I'm not going to fight with that darn thing. But anyway, I just wanted to show y'all that, and I'll put it down below. And give you her information if you want to contact her. And you can go on her site and um, look at some of the other stuff that she made. I think she said that um, she has got a bunch of new pieces in. Uh, she made a bunch of new pieces. So, y'all go check her out. Alright, so I'm going to get into my haul. And I sure hope I got it sorted out because... Everything is in these bags. I put them in these big, um, you know those big bags that you get like when you're shopping and uh, like if you're in TJ Maxx or Marshalls or uh, anywhere really they got them now. Even Dollar Tree has them. But you can buy them for 99 cents, those big like colorful bags and stuff like that. I buy those all the time because whenever I shop at Aldi's I'll have bags to take in with me. So I put my groceries in them. But I put all of my stuff in those bags because you can't see through them and the kids can't look and see what I got in there. So I got four bags packed. So this stuff here came from um, came from Walmart. Maybe while I'm showing it to you, I can throw some of this stuff together of whose is whose. Well, I don't know what that is. Oh, I do know. That was a <coughs> a gift card that um, I had that I used. Okay, here, this right here, guys, at Walmart's. This is 10, 10, 10 pair, 10 pair of socks for five dollars they were like five 
I don't have my receipt. But they were like five something. You know, closer to six dollars. But ten pair at Walmart's. I was surprised. So, yeah, I got ten pair of these for five dollars. You know, and they're nice. So, I got these for Tara. I got these for Tara. Because every morning she comes in here and she gets in my sock drawer. I buy that kid socks all the time. I don't know what she does with them. I don't know if she eats them or what she's doing with them. But what she wears them one time, I never see them again. I don't see them in the wash. I don't see them in the dirty clothes basket. I don't see them. I don't know what she does with them. But anyway, maybe she'll keep up with these. She loves Hello Kitty. So I got her a pair of these and they were a dollar. But aren't those cute? So I got those socks for Tara. I try to always get them panties and socks, sometimes bras, um, stuff, just little stuff like that, that, you know, they always get mad when they pull it out of the package and shove it back down in there real fast. Give me the dirty look, the ugly eyes. <laughs> but I got these for Sadie. These were $5. Um, a little over five dollars but there's six pair six pair in here and she loves these kind of socks she loves them she's in the hospital she get they give her hospital socks she keeps them forever and i hate them ugly yellow socks but anyway i bought her some of those so i bought those for tara and sadie and then um for Abby's other grandma, and I hope she, she does watch me. I hope she's not watching this. Um, I didn't know what in the world to get her, but so I went. I got her something ordered from Shein. She loves Elvis. She loves Elvis. So I ordered her, her something really cute from Shein that I'm not going to say it because in case she is watching. But, um... I hope that it comes in and that it's here on time by Christmas. Because she's going she's gonna to take Abby this weekend and um, keep her and bring her home Christmas Eve. So we'll kind of do our Christmas with them on Christmas Eve. And I, I am keeping my fingers crossed that it comes in before then. So days are passing by so fast and I ain't seen nothing come in the mail yet. So I'm getting kind of worried. But anyway... I got her this nightgown at, um, well, it's a pajama set at Walmart's. It's not um, something that she would have to put her house coat over because it's not real thick. Short sleeves, and it's got the knee pants to go with it. She's, she's short herself, so these knee pants go long down on her. So I got that for her. In case that other doesn't come in. But I really hope it does. And she'll have two two things. So I got that for her. And I got to go and pick them up. At, I'm going to give them a, a gift card. They love Chili's. So I'm going to get a gift card to Chili's for them. And Debbie, if you're watching me, act like you didn't hear that. So I got these for my husband. A big old pack of socks. It's 12 pair of double tough durable over the calf tube socks. He likes to wear these because he wears the boots to work every day. Um, steel toe boots. So he does this so his boots won't rub his leg. He likes these long socks like that. So, you know Christmas time, you always get new underwear and socks. I don't know what it is about Christmas, but Christmas rolls around. It's time to get new uh, underclothes. <laughs> My mom used to always do that to us. And then when she started living with me, I'd always make sure I bought her new underclothes for Christmas. Every year when she lived here, I'd got her... New socks, new panties, new bras, and new house, um, new, uh, nightgowns and house coats and stuff like that. She loves stuff like that. 
So that's what I'd get her. And then on Easter, I'd always buy her a new dress. New dress for church. So, she loved that. <coughs> so, I'm still in Walmart. Okay, so I went and Tara wants these huge clothes to wear. I don't understand it. I don't know why. But she wears way up in the plus sizes. And she's little. She's only, she'll be 12, you know. And she don't wear but about a size 6. So, but she wears these big baggy clothes all the time. I don't get it at all. So, anyway, she wanted new jackets. So, I got her um, two new hoodies. Double XL is what she wanted. Don't ask me. I don't know. But anyway, I got that for her. Got her a black one. I got her a gray one. Black and gray. And I got her a pair of uh, gray jogging pants. She likes these big, too. I just bought a large. I wasn't going to... About to buy her no two double X in these. So, I mean, these are these are going to be huge on her. So, I refuse to buy that big pants. For her little bitty body. But, got her those. And these jackets are like $16 a piece. So, they're not cheap. They're not cheap, but... They're not Timu either. They're not that big, thick, spongy material. You know, they're cotton. I think they're cotton. Not saying that the bad about Timu on their spongy stuff because I have tons of spongy sweatshirts and I love them. But she don't. She don't love him. Put her Hello Kitty deals that I showed y'all last night over in her little sack. Okay, so. Mmm, <coughs> sounds bad. Um, Sadie wanted new art supplies. So I bought Sadie a bunch of new art supplies. I bought her um, a bunch of different colors of acrylic paint. She loves to paint. She loves to draw. Um, if I can think about it, uh, one of these days I'll get in there and I'll get a hold of her art book and I'll show y'all some of the beautiful artwork that she has drawn. You you would be surprised how talented she is. Like just it's it's amazing. She amazes me how smart she is and how talented she is. You know, and I just hate it that she goes through what she goes through. But I got her some, also got her some water, water color paint. In case she wants to, she does acrylic, she does watercolor. And then I got her some new brushes. She needs new brushes. And then I got her a real thick, um, she was, said that she really needed this. It's that real thick um, paper. I mean, it's really thick. Look how thick that paper is. But this is for painting. You can water paint on it or acrylic paint or what have you. So, Artist Studio Pad. I mean, that's not cheap. It's not real high either. Eleven dollars. I mean, you know, it's not. It's not too much. So I got her all that, all that art supply stuff that she asked for. Let's see what else I got? Showed you all that. Yeah, showed you all that. I'm gonna put it back down in the sack. I'm gonna try to get some of it underneath my tree tonight. But, you know, it's already 8 o'clock. I've been saying that I was going to get on here. 
and uh, get my haul done. Uh-oh. So I could uh, get some of it wrapped and put under the tree, but I'm pooped. I'm pootering out real fast. So, I don't know if I'll get any of it wrapped and underneath the tree or not. I'm not going to wrap a whole lot. I got a bunch of sacks. I'm going to put a bunch of this in sacks and just do that. Do it that way. Sack. Sack it up. So, let's see what else I got. Oh, okay. I got all of this stuff. I think. I got all of this, yeah, here. Oh no, I didn't that one. That one there I bought at the drugstore. Because I paid, paid kind of pricey for that. So let me put it in this back. So I can show y'all that, that I bought at the drugstore with the drugstore stuff. And all of this comes from the Dollar Tree. So I put that in there with the Dollar Tree stuff. So that way I can show y'all where I got what, from where, from where I got what, I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. I got a bunch of tissue paper that's flying in the wind over there at the end of the bed. Miss Layla needed some of it. And I used some of it for to mail my UPS package off today. I'm going to go over there and get a couple of bags, and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. What y'all's, uh, y'all have a New Year's resolution this year? What y'all's New Year's resolution? I'll tell y'all something about me that y'all probably don't know. That is, I smoke. It's a horrible, horrible habit. And I've already talked to my doctor about it, and she's already um, subscribed me the um, prescribed, prescribed me the patches. So I'm on the patch. <laughs> and that's my um, New Year's resolution is to quit these darn cigarettes. They're expensive. And I'm already having trouble. I got pneumonia and now I got this mess. And they're just bad for you. They stink. They make your clothes stink. I mean, I'm not knocking y'all smokers out there that don't want to hear this. But I'm just saying for myself. For myself. My husband smokes. For me and him. We're getting older. And we don't need this in our life. And I tell you what. I have laid them down. I have just laid them down and walked away from them for 10 years at a time. I've done that twice and then go right back to it. I quit smoking because whenever I was raising my boys and I had, um, I had Samuel, the baby, and he was born premature and he was born sick. So uh, I didn't smoke whenever my kids were little. And, you know, when I got pregnant, I'd quit smoking, and I went smoke through my whole pregnancy. And then when the babies were born, I didn't never pick them back up. So, I went years without smoking. I went through a darn divorce and started smoking again. And I uh, smoked for a long time, and then got remarried, and laid them down again. And I quit. Quit for ten more years. <laughs> and got divorced and um went to smoking and uh I picked them back up and I haven't stopped smoking now and I've been smoking now for about mm, eight years eight or nine years yeah, probably eight or nine years I've been smoking again. So, it's time for me to lay them down for good and never pick them back up. So, that's really, really what I want to do. So, I'm praying about it. And the doctor's helping me with my patches. 
and I'm going to quit. I am. I can do it. I've done it before. So, yeah, it's a nasty habit. But, okay, back to this. I got Layla one of these, these hoodies, too. Oh, no. No, this one is for Sadie. This one's Sadie. It's not a zip-up jacket. It's just a pullover hoodie. She wanted one of those. So I got that for her. I need to go find her some jogging pants because she's been barring Layla. All this stuff is in black. And then I got Layla. I got Layla one too, but I just got hers in a large. She didn't want one of those big old things. So I got her one. Reason why I got... See, they done picked out a bunch of stuff online. And um, I ordered all of that. And that was their money, pretty much, that I gave them. I told them that they could have. But me being me, I just don't think that they never have enough. And so I just add on to that. So I end up spending a lot more on them. So, these kids are spoilt. So, I got these Jack Black um, pajama pants for Sadie because she loves this nightmare. Nightmare um, before Christmas. Isn't that what it is, Nightmare for Christmas? So, and I got her a big old sleeping shirt. I tell you what, um, they sleep in. My son that passed away, uh, they wanted to keep all his shirts. He was a big man. So, you know, he wore like three X's. So that's what they sleep in every night. Uh, Sadie and Tara. So, and they're so worn out. They got holes in them. They look like, they look horrible, but that's what they want to wear. And I don't make them uh, do any different. But I did get... Sadie, a big shirt and in Pink Floyd. She likes Pink Floyd. So, I did get her this big shirt hoping that maybe, just maybe she'll get rid of, the, put the yellow one up in a, in a, you know, keepsake box. I'll get it washed up and put it in one of my, those plastic Timu bags and just put it up and she can keep it. So, I'm hoping that she'll let me do that since I bought her up. A big one. She might not. I don't know. So, let's see what all I got in here. I don't know where this is. Oh, this is this is Dollar Tree stuff. Yeah. Some more Dollar Tree stuff. Put it in there. I didn't realize I got so much stuff at the Dollar Tree. I got a lot of stuff from the Dollar Tree. You know, a lot of stocking stuff or stuff. Where'd this come from? Okay, this came from the Family Dollar. I guess I did go to Family Dollar. Here's some more Walmart stuff. <coughs> Excuse me. Hey, I got these for Samuel, for my son. He wanted some ankle socks, so I got him 12 pair of ankle socks. Um from Walmart and I got him underwear this pack here they had this big old pack 10 pack of underwear for $18 18 something so that was a pretty good deal for these Fruit of the Loom uh, boxer briefs that he loves so I didn't buy my husband any this year but he informed me that if I had that I need to give them to him early because the elastic is worn out of his and he needs some new ones. <laughs> he killed me and he knew I told all y'all that. But he's done worn the elastic out of them. <coughs> so I guess I guess I'll be making a trip back to Walmart to get him some underwear. I gotta go back anyway because I'm not done with Abby. I don't have anything that I'm gonna show y'all for Abby because Abby's stuff is in the garage. If she sees it, forget it. You're gonna have to give it to her because she throws one more fit. 
She don't understand why she can't have it. She don't understand why she's got to wait. So, it's just best not to even mess with that. So, I just keep it in the garage. And I guess I'm just going to have to put it in a... And it's, it's bigger stuff. Like, I got her a, a, a big dollhouse. You know, it's it's big. It's about, it's about that big. It's got a little car in it. It's got some people and some furniture and stuff. And the doorbell rings. And uh, it was on that aisle where uh, they have a whole bunch of... Walmart has like this whole big line of stuff that it's called Kids Something. It's like Walmart brand. And they're like 1997 for that big stuff like that. Well... She's little. I mean, there's no sense in going and buying like a $200 dollhouse whenever she's going to lose the pieces and it's going to get tore up. So, whenever she gets older and she's more into Barbies, and I can't wait for that because that was my favorite thing to do when I was little is to play with Barbie dolls. My mama, of course, I was the last kid. Um, I was the baby. I was the last kid at home. And I was spoiled. Mama had me um, later in life. She was like, Mama was 35 when she had me. So, and all the other kids were grown and married and done had kids of their own. And uh, me and my brother was the only one at home. And then, of course, he was uh, six years older than me. So, you know, he was already a teenager and doing his own thing. So... I got everything I wanted. I mean, Mama just, you know, my, my daddy had passed away when I was real young, so she got checks on us, and of course she had remarried, and they owned a restaurant and stuff, so just whatever money come from my daddy, she would just let us spend it. And I had every Barbie doll you could think of. I had Fair Fawcett, I had Cher, um, I had the original G.I. Joe's, the one that had the hair, and of course that was their boyfriend. So, uh, I had the boat, I had the house, I had the cars, you name it. I had everything Barbie. You know, if I would have kept that stuff, it would have been worth a lot of money today. Especially like that Cher doll and that Fair Fawcett. It would have been worth a ton of money. But of course, you know, you don't think that. And, you know, they would have been like, uh, I guess, the late 60s the, into the 70s Barbie dolls. So, yeah, they'd have been worth a lot of money. I, I really wish that I would have kept all that. But I had nieces that was younger, and um, I passed everything down to them. I just boxed it all up and passed it on to the twins. My oldest sister had twins and Lisa and Teresa and they love to play with Barbies so I just packed up all my Barbie stuff and gave it to them gave it to the babies so you know I don't know what happened to all that but yeah I had everything everything you can imagine I would have just loved to, to sit back and and uh, look at all that stuff now I love Barbie so you know, I had boys. I know I'm just ratted alone, but I had boys. I always wanted girls, and I had two boys. So, I never got to buy anything like that. And, uh, what was funny was, uh, Mama didn't hardly have no grandsons. She had a lot of granddaughters. So, all my sisters had girls. Um, except for for my one sister, she had a uh, she had a boy, and my brother had a boy. So uh, then my mama had let's see, and then I had two boys. So she had four. She had Chris and Alex and Samuel and Les. She had four, and then Gavin came along. She had five. Yeah, she only had like five grandsons. But she had a mess of granddaughters. A bunch of them. 
and I thought, it ain't no problem. I'm going to have girls because everybody had girls. I'm not, you know, I'm not even going to worry about it. I bought all girls stuff, um, baby stuff, and went down there. Sonnerette said, you're going to have a boy. I cried. I cried and cried and cried. And my husband at the time, Terry, told me, he said, I'm going to tell him when he gets big that you cried when you found out he was a boy. <laughs> but, boy, I tell you what, I couldn't have loved him no more and a girl than anything in this world. I love that kid so much. Uh, you know, I love both of my boys, but uh, I sure wanted a, a girl so I could play Barbie dolls. But you know what? Then my son got up and all he had was girls. And guess what? I'm raising three girls now. Four, really, with Abby. So I've had my share of plenty, plenty, plenty buying Barbie dolls. But I, I still can't wait till Abby gets old enough so I can buy, buy her a Barbie doll. So, she's not into them that much. She's kind of a tomboy. She likes trucks and cars and tractors and stuff. <laughs> so, I just let her be her. So, enough of that, Radley. Let me get on with my haul. Okay, I think that's... I think that's all I got from... Uh, all I got from Walmart. All this stuff... All of this stuff is from the Dollar Tree. And it's stuff from the Dollar Tree. Let's scoot that over. <coughs> Sorry about all the redmen. Oh no. This bag here came from Walmart. Now this is Abby's stocking set. Well, these are Layla's. She wanted these uh, indoor chocolates. Oh, man, I love these things. I could open it up with this old bag tonight. But I'm not. It's her Christmas stuff. So, I got her this. She said, Mimi, I don't want nothing in my stocking except for the Lindor chocolates. And I said, all right. So, I got her that bag to put in her stocking. I got Abby this. This was like $3 at Walmart. So... It's got 10 lollipops in it, but she'll like that. It's her favorite thing is lollipops. I got her these ring pops. Some more, some more lollipops. Milk duds. You know who those are for. Those are mine, and it's not for Christmas, so I'm going to put them over here. <laughs> I got her some bottle caps. I hadn't seen these in forever. I haven't seen bottle caps in forever. We used, to, we used to eat these when I was a kid. Some bottle caps. Got her some power punch straws. She, I don't know if she'll like those or not. She'll probably have her mouth all puckered up. And then Sour Patch Twist. Little snowman. It's cute. Then I got her some... Um, Sweet and Sour Reindeers. Walmart. And then I got her a Push Pop. Another little deal at Walmart that they have a snowman on top of it. So, this is her bag of candy. I'm sure her daddy will buy her more. She don't need all this candy. She's pretty good about not just sitting down and eating a whole lot of it. She might get a, a sucker or, you know, a couple of pieces and, and just go on about her way and, you know, eat it slow. She's not one to just open it all up and eat it, eat it, eat it. She don't do that. Get down here again. Uh, I don't know what that is. What is that? Fell down in there. I let something come out of the car. I got these, uh, this is a Dollar Tree now that I'm going to show y'all. Got these, uh, tapes. Uh, I was watching Nona and Grumpy Grandpa. And she was talking about going to the Dollar Tree. She said she was coming to Texas. Uh, I think her son lives in Houston. Her son and her daughter. 
and they they come down here a lot and I'd like to drive up and see her and meet her but I'm I'm a ways away from Houston about six or seven hours but um, anyway uh, she was talking about things she said that she went in there to buy some and she said there was a package of one uh, tape you know by itself just one tape by itself and then she said there was a package of two tapes for $1.25. She said, you know, what makes more sense to pick up the two pack or the one pack for $1.25? So, it's so funny. I was in the Dollar Tree and I had picked up two packs of these um, for my gift wrap and stuff. And I thought of her because there was a lady there and she was looking at the bags by me. And, um, uh, there was some tape hang, hanging on the little strip thing right there by the bags. And it was one, one deal of tape. And she picked one up and she's about to put it in her basket. And I said, you know, if you go over there to that bin, um, there's some of these scotch tapes. And it's two to a package instead of you buying just that one. She goes, she really appreciated that, that I told her that. She thanked me and thanked me. So, I thought of Nona. So, Nona, if you're watching me, I thought of you when I was at the Dollar Tree. And I directed that lady to what you hey. told me. So. Uh-oh. Abby's crying. Let me go see what's going on. Be right back, guys. Okay, let me see if I can finish this. She was throwing a fit. And it took me a while to calm her down. She came in here and we had to work with her sticker book that I got her today. I went ahead and gave it to her. But she loves sticker books. <laughs> this little sticker book. You, uh, it has stickers in it. Like that. And you make your faces. Look at this one that she made. <laughs> Me and her sit here and done about three faces. Calm her down. So, let me get back to this. Hopefully she will be occupied with Layla for just a little bit. Um, let me do this real small uh, thing. Mm. Yeah, that's all Dollar Tree stuff. I think that's all Dollar Tree stuff. It is. Okay, that's all Dollar Tree stuff. And that is too. I think y'all see what I got at Family Dollar real fast. I got some um, lights for Abby. I buy these. They're like $5 and something for three packs. I keep these around all the time. In my car. In Samuel's car. All around the house for the baby. So, that's not Christmas. That's just something that I picked up that I needed. But, um, see if I can find my glasses. Some of this stuff's little. Okay, I got Tara some new, uh, powder because hers is all worn out and gone. So it's just that translucent powder, loose powder. I don't like this stuff myself because it's messy. But she does, she likes it. So I got her one of those. All this stuff is just going to be in a little... I got... These here at the Dollar Tree, these little boxes, they're so cute. But I got these like to put um, this makeup in or any kind of little jewelry or anything that comes in from Timu. I don't know what all's coming in from Timu because I done forgot. I'd have to go back and look through my order. But um, yeah, I got a few of these boxes to put stuff like that in from the Dollar Tree. So I got... Uh, her some really pretty, and I won't swatch any of this because I don't want to open it because it's for their Christmas. But that's got a bad glare in it from the ring light. But anyway, they're really pretty. The LA colors. I found that the LA colors really work. Um, they work really well. And then I got eyeliner, black liquid eyeliner for all of them. Because they all like this stuff. 
I use the heck out of that stuff. I don't use eyeliner simply because I get it all over my face. I got um, one of these really pretty palette as well. I wish that ring light wouldn't show up in this so much because y'all can't really see what the colors look like. But these are the nudes. That's, yeah, the nude. That's the nude color. And this is cool colors. So that's those. Give them like a smoky eye. And then I got this for Sadie. It's that uh, fantasy body fantasies the spray this is coconut it smells really good and then I got this one to put in their stocking or whatever the Japanese cherry blossom got that for them they spray the heck out of their stuff it is in the mornings they choke a choke a chicken as much as stuff they put on and then eyelash glue And I got Layla some too and I had to end up giving it to her early because she kept wanting to take her to the store to buy some. So I just gave it to her. So I got, that's my family uh, dollar haul there. I guess this is all I got from Walmart uh, from the Walgreens. Did I get this from Walgreens? Did I? Yeah, I did. Got this, and I bought the cards today. Got these for Sadie. She loves these. Loves, loves, loves them. They're the um, Peppermint Bark Collection. I got the dark chocolate and the Peppermint Bark, and then they have the um, Snowman Peppermint Bark. So, yeah, she loves these. She loves them. And then pick this stuff up at Walgreens. Some more body spray. Vanilla sugar cookie. I love you. Smells really good. And then the hand cream. And then I got Layla this. Um forget who puts this out. R I M M E L. I don't really know how to pronounce that, so I'm not gonna try. But it's the gloss. I had to smart down to like two dollars forty seven cents, I think, or something like that. So it's originally like I think either six ninety nine or eight ninety nine, I can't remember. But this particular color was marked down and it's a good color for her. So I picked that up for her. So that's my Walgreens. So now I'll get into my Dollar Tree. Leaning back on the bed because I'm trying to grab this box. I already showed it to you. I got two of these same kind with the. I'm trying to put everything under my tree the same theme, which is snowmen. I'm trying to put all snowmen under snowmans or snowmen underneath the Christmas tree. I got uh, snowmen wrapping paper, which I don't have. This is blue wrapping paper from. Uh, the Dollar Tree, and I left it in the car. So, I got that, and then I got these two things as snowmen. And after Christmas, I usually go around and look and see what all people's got on sale. You know, and they mark it down to like 50%, 75% at Walmart's, you know, after a while. And I, I usually buy a lot of decorations that way. And I'll take out my old ones, you know, that I've had for 100 years and replace them, which I've pretty much replaced everything now with newer stuff. But I'd like to replace all of it with snowmen. I like snowmen. I really do. I think they're so stinking cute. So I'd like to replace, like, all my knickknacks and stuff like that with snowmen. So I got these for Christmas Day, the napkins on Christmas, and then I got the plates to match, two deals in the plates. This is for like dessert, um, 
for Christmas. We don't do turkey and ham and stuff like that. We've done, been doing this tradition for years and years and years. Um, we do a Mexican dinner. Um, I buy 10 dozen tamales every year for Christmas. Anywhere from 10 to 12 dozen. I know y'all think that's a lot, but as big as my family is, they go. So, I've got uh, two chicken coming and two cheese and jalapenos coming and then what's that? That's four, six. I got six dozen coming of pork and then two chicken and two jalapeno. But we get tamales and then I'll do like a big pan of enchiladas, something like that. And then we'll do rice and beans and then chips and I'll make my homemade salsa. We'll have that and then I'll have a cheese dip. And then usually I put up snack stuff like a cheese ball, you know, with little crackers and stuff around it. And uh, put out another little tray with olives and pickles and little hand snack stuff that they can pick up and snack with their hands. But we have people that come in and out, in and out. And I like to have all that stuff. That way, you know, they'll come in, they feel welcome, and then they can eat. Anybody that comes to my house, I love for them to eat. So, I always got something that uh, they can pick up and eat whenever they come here. But, um, got to make some candy because I promised the kids last year I didn't make haystacks. And I never heard the end of it. So, this year I'm going to make some haystacks. Um, and uh, make some other little different candy stuff that I can make a big tray out of you know this and that some chocolate covered pretzels and stuff like that but um, maybe some cake balls some uh, yeah cake balls but I'm gonna do all that and then probably have like you know a dessert section like a pumpkin pie and a pecan pie and cheesecake. I always do cheesecake because Sadie. But you get my drift. That's what we do for Christmas around here. It's a it's a pretty big deal. We do a big a big get up. Just like Thanksgiving. But I got these. I thought these were so cute. They're name tags and they're kind of puffy. They kind of stick out like that. They're really cute. I guess they got some kind of sticker on the back of them. You just peel the sticker off it. I don't know where you put the name at. I think when you open them up, they open up. And then you put the name inside and then it just... I don't know. Let's open it and see. Well, I ain't got my scissors. Use my teeth. Which ain't working. Well, maybe I won't open them. There it goes. I know people hate it when I do that. I'll be darn, I can't get it out. I'm gonna tear it up. It's happening. What in the world? Okay, yeah. So, it's like that. It opens up, and then it's got a little sticker deal in the back. I guess that you peel off and stick on there. I hope. I don't see anything that peels off, though. I don't know. I might have tore it up. I might have took it off there wrong or something. I have no idea. Or maybe you're supposed to... Maybe you're supposed to figure it out and stick them yourself with some tape. I guess. Because that one came right off. A sticky deal. Anyway, that's what they look like. I'll just put a piece of tape on the back. It'll work out fine. But anyway, I thought those were cute. They're different. So, picked up some more socks here. I'll just pick these up for Layla. They're just some cheap little socks that I picked up for her 
I didn't, didn't end up picking her up any at Walmart. She was with me, that's why. So, got her those. She's pretty good about keeping up with her socks. I got me this. It's not for Christmas. It's just a dish, um, a dish drying mat. I got this for the kitchen. I had bought me a, two other ones that are plaid. I really like these. <laughs> that shot across the room. But it's like that. It's thicker, you know. I have a dishwasher that dries them, but like, you know, any kind of Abbey drinks that have like those straws in them or whatever, and uh, my Stanley Cup dupes. You know, I don't put those in the dishwasher, so I hand wash. I hand wash a few things. My wooden um, utensils that I keep in my utensil deal, I wash those, so anything that I have. And of course, if I'm cooking a big supper, I'll put this over there and I'll wash dishes as I go in the sink. Instead of loading my dishwasher, I'll just, if I use the bowl, I'll just wash it and put it over there to dry and put it up. So, anyway, I got that for that. And these are no-nos. I've, I've got a few subscribers that's really gotten on to me about this. But these are passies. These are Abby's passies and this is not for Christmas. She bought some. She's old enough where she needs to be taken off of it. And she bites holes in them. But she don't suck on them all the time, like all day long. She might have it at night, fall asleep with it, but try not to give it to her all the time. Okay, at the Dollar Tree, got two of these. These look pretty cool. Um, let me get my glasses on. This is Fierce Black. Gives you a before and after. What is it though? I think it's mascara. It's mascara. But look, they look really expensive. I've never seen these before at the Dollar Tree. Gives you that before and after picture. Know how much that is true, but I got two of them. Got two of those. I don't know who I'll give. Uh oh. Hold on, guys. Sorry, Abby's in the room. She has her. She has my makeup deal that I wash my face. Makeup deal, the sponge deal that makes noise that spins around and around I clean my face with. She has that in its own. So, um, I got three of these eyeliners, some more liquid eyeliner, because they, like I said, they use the heck out of this stuff. I picked up some little trash bags, which I need to take out of these sacks, because I need them now. They're for my trash cans in the bathroom. I need to take those out. I need to take out this stuff that I need to use right now. I just didn't go through this stuff and get out what I needed. I'm my second book. Your, your sticker book? Yeah. It's over here. Can you help me for it? Uh, I'll try to, but I'm going to talk while I'm helping you. Is that okay? Yes, that's okay. You can talk while you're out of me. Okay. Let me put some of this stuff there. Hold on. You got me some of this old poppy? I did. I did, I did. Can I help her? Yes, ma'am. Okay, go ahead. Guys, I'm just putting some of this stuff out of the way because she's going to get up on the bed and get into all of it. There's your sticker book. Can you open that all by yourself? Hmm? Yeah. Can you do it? Can look, can you turn around and say hi? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> I got, I had a pocket in my, I have a pocket in my. You're tearing it up in little pieces. Can we need help you please? Yeah. That's, I, I, there you I, go. That, I start, that's, 
girls. Throwing that down the floor, I pick it up That's later. That's your girls. Yeah, honey, it is. You can have this bag, but I'll just put some stuff in it, okay? You can put your car. Here's another little it's gingerbread it's house that I can put some stuff in. I don't, I don't want to put my cards in there, silly Willie. Okay, I'll show y'all what's in this bag. Yeah, hang on one second, love. I got some brushes for the girls. Picked up some brushes. Um, picked up several colors of lipstick for Layla. I thought these were really pretty, these colors. So it's a dual pack. So I got those two colors for her. Never seen these before. This was something new at the Dollar Tree. It's a makeup correcting gel pen. It's for your, it says it helps with mistakes on your brows, lips, and eyes. So I'm going to check that out. I bought me one. And I bought the girls, I bought the girls one too. So, got another one of those. And got another brush. These brush, I love these brushes. I got it. All right. Let's put it somewhere. Let's put it this here I've never seen either. It says two and in one. On you two wash glue liner black. So I don't know what that means. Like it's a glue, but it's a liner too. I didn't get it. Oh, I just dropped. So I'll get it, baby. I'll yeah. get it. You're okay. Thank you. What? But so I got two where of those. Can I put this? I don't know. T uh, turn your page and see what where it needs to go. Could it go on his page somewhere? Maybe. What is that? What is that? That's a that's a message. It says Jolly. I don't know what that means. It, jo you don't know what Jolly means? Let's put it right that here. That means happy. Let's put it. Let's put it Here's right some here. lip gloss. I got that for Tara. I, I, I found a place, maybe right here, maybe right here, yeah, right here, right here, right here. Oh, that's a good idea. Put it on that side, yeah. That's to so, be, got this to me, another to me, lip gloss. I got several me. lip glosses for them, and I don't know who I'll give to who and what and whatever. I'll just, whenever I go to... Passing it out and making their little deals. I'll hey, figure it out. I thought I, I would take the gingerbread. Yeah, you got the gingerbread man. Yeah, that's for somewhere. Got one of these uh, pressed powders for Layla. Got her one of those. I got some blush. I thought this blush was really pretty. Look at that. See how it goes on. I I did I did my face. <laughs> Here is a slim felt tip smudge proof. Look, look, now I see her eye maker blue. Look at this. Look. It's like an eyeliner deal. Look. I, I protect it new. Alright. I protect it new. Good job. I got it new. That's great. You I, did a good job. I did it new. I bought three of these. Hey. Hey. Um, Sadie probably won't want one. I bought one for myself because I did open hey. one of them and, hey. and try it out. Hey. What love book? Can you play with me? Where's my sticker book? Well, I'm talking right now. Okay, you do it while you're I don't even know who put this put this out, but pressed pigment. Where where does this what where Chrome is, Crush where, Copper? Where was the But anyway I did open the, one of them and I put it on my hand. The, the pigmentation of it is great. It's Ooh. so pretty. It's oh, really pretty. Oh. Abby, now, honey, you can't do that while Mimi's trying to talk, okay? That's not very nice. It's kind of rude. Okay. So, you're going to have to figure out your little sticker book for one minute because Mimi's almost done. Okay, and then I'll, help me! 
and then I'll play with you, okay? No, no help me right now. Um, I got some, a bunch of sacks to put my stuff in. Of course, I tried to pick up all snowmen, because you know I told you that it's I was going to try to do them all in snowmen. So I got several got sacks. This for me. Bunch of sacks. You got this for me? Yeah, I got that one for you. Bubbles? Yeah, let's show them. Let's show them what it is. They got these new deals at the Dollar Tree. I couldn't find... This was the last one, and Trolls. I grabbed it. Trolls. It's a troll... Um, it's a body wash, shampoo, and conditioner all in one. They smell really good, because I had bought her some different kind that was in there, like um, Frozen, Elsa, and, An and Anna. What's their names, honey? Elsa... Elsa and Anna. Elsa and Anna. And then I got Blippi, right? We got Blippi. You know, I'm going to tell you the rest of the story when okay. you're busy. When you're busy. Okay. I'm going to tell you the rest when you're busy. Anyway, this smells really good. Hey. It's a big bottle. Do you know why I've seen these like at the Dollar Store, the Family Dollar, and the Dollar General? And these things run it anywhere doesn't. from like five dollars and something to eight dollars, depending on you know how many ounces in it <laughs> is it. This is fourteen ounces in this. Mm. You okay? You need me to get you Kleenex? Yeah. But um, anyway, I picked that one up for her. That was the only one left. I'd have bought I'd have bought several of them because I really one? like it. Can I get some? Can I just tell about the stories? I will in a minute. Please, 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 please. You were telling me the story in the car. But then I had to come and talk to my friends. So after I talk to my friends, I'll listen to your story and I'll play with you in your sticker bit. Okay? I but, promise. But I, I bought some more bags. I bought some this size. And then I bought some teeny tiny ones for like jewelry and stuff like that. These come to like turn, two in a package turn, and these come to three in a package. Turn it off. Don't be ugly. These people are here. And, and, you know, all these and, nice. And, and, and to listen. All these nice people like and, you so much and, and they, they and, think and, you're such and, a good girl. And try, and try, and try to talk to you. It's been difficult for that. Um, I found these at the Dollar Tree. They're makeup blenders and they're stars. I thought those were cute to put in their stockings. Hey. I found these cute socks. It's a, uh, they look like that. I like these kind. I just bought these for myself. And it's got a bicycle and it's got presents on the back of it. <laughs> Aren't those cute? I'm gonna leave those out because they're not Christmas. <laughs> I usually don't get anything that gets put underneath the Christmas tree because if I get anything, I buy it for myself. Well, my son usually buys me something. Okay. But, um, I can't get this. I can't get this. Let me help you. I'm going to help her I real fast. this one. That one. What are those? Those are ladybug wings. Oh, okay. There I you go. Want, I wanted them. All right. Let's find uh, them. Uh, you want to put them on that page? Uh, Maybe, um... But, anyway, I usually here. don't have anything underneath there for myself or my husband because he just don't shop. He doesn't... He doesn't... Birthday... No birthday gifts, no Christmas gifts, no anniversary gifts. He's just not the kind of person that gives gifts, so... I usually always still buy for him, but... He's just hey. not that kind of person, and... Play me. He just doesn't do Play it. me. So, I got all these Where bags I showed you. Is that, is that the end? I had to go to two Dollar Trees to find boxes. Couldn't find no boxes this year. Finally, I went to a bigger one that was way out, you know, on another little part of town. And I found some. found these that had mm -hmm. the snowmen on them. But I, I, I bought them. those two, and then I bought a... a I bought some in this shape, and I bought two of these big bags because she's got some big stuff that can't be wrapped or whatever, and I'll just throw them in these big bags for her. 
And then I got um, some great big bags. <laughs> I got bags, bags, bags. To be surprised, I'll end up not having enough. Got some more paper. What, love? What? I will in a minute. And got some more boxes. That me. And um, I'm gonna read you these two cards, and that that's all of my. Oh, and I got ribbon that I wrap with my presents. But if I don't have a lot of boxes that I'm gonna wrap, I won't even be using this stuff. How do how do I don't know, love. But um. Anyway, so that's mostly all my... Hold on, guys, one second. Okay, guys, I'm back. She said she'd be a good girl now. So. She got in trouble, but she's going to be a good girl. Aren't you, sweetheart? So, I'm going to read you these two cards I got. I'm going to give my son some money for Christmas, so I bought him one of these card money holder cards. It says, stocking stuffers are nice. But wallet stuffers are even nicer. Merry Christmas. <laughs> I got him that. I love Christmas. You love it? Yeah. This is the best Christmas in the world in my life. Really? Yeah. Oh, I'm so happy. Um, Got this card I thought was real cute. It I, says, a holiday I, poem. I just... I just I, I just read to my buddy, I just hit the card. Really? It's okay. Yeah. I'm just playing with it. Yeah. I'm just reading it around. That's why I just like food and buddies, all right. That's right. All day. It I says a holiday poem. It yeah. says, when Christmas gets stressful and tense, and tense as can be. Remember the angel on the top of your tree who keeps smiling joyfully no matter what. Then inside it says, just think how you'd feel with a tree up your butt. <laughs> Try not to think about it and enjoy your holidays. <laughs> I thought that was so cute. <laughs> I got that for nobody in particular. I just picked it up because I thought it was funny. <laughs> so that's all of my dollar, my um, Dollar Tree haul, my Walmart haul, and um, what else did I show y'all? Um, the Family Dollar, Walgreens. Uh, I believe that's it. So, oh, thank you, love, bud. She gave me some tissue. But I think that's it. Now, maybe tomorrow, since it's already too late, maybe tomorrow I can um, get all this stuff wrapped up and put it underneath the Christmas tree. Can you help me wrap this stuff tomorrow and put it under the Christmas tree? Yes, yes. Yes, yes. We're going to do that tomorrow, okay? Maybe Sadie can help. You think Sadie, Sadie's got to go to school? Maybe Santa can help. Santa? Santa Santa can help. Is he coming over here? Yeah, and, and, and he can come and play with me. He's coming to play with you? He can play and play with my sticker book with me. <gasps> He's playing your sticker book with you too? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Did y'all hear that? Santa's coming to town. And he can play with me with all my toys with me. <laughs> That's right. He can play my sticker butt wherever he, he wants. Yeah. <laughs> he has to ride to sleigh. Take this out so I can understand you. What'd you say? Um, maybe maybe they'll let me ride to sleigh and, and maybe you can come and ride it with me and go to the sky and ride it. Really? Mm-hmm. Wow. Maybe me and you will watch a Christmas movie tonight. Want to? And, and go. There might be TV and there might be TV. There might be um TV in the living room. I bet there is a TV in the living room. Yeah. I bet there's not. 
<laughs> in our living room? Yeah. <laughs> you know there's a TV in there, silly willy. Anyway, guys, won't keep y'all any longer. If y'all stay till the end, thank you so much for staying till the end. And hope y'all enjoyed this haul. I always enjoy showing y'all and talking to y'all. But, um... I'll be seeing y'all again um, this week. So, hopefully my stuff starts coming in. Keeping my fingers crossed, guys. Because can't go a lot of that. Baby, I don't know, honey. And quit, quit acting like that. Here. I will in just a minute. I'm saying bye, okay? But, <coughs> anyway... Um, I appreciate all y'all and if you're watching me tonight and you're not subscribed go ahead and subscribe it's kind of fun over here but um, uh, if y'all will push that like button the thumbs up and um, send me some comments and I'll try my best to get on there and answer them I'm trying to do better I really am I got so behind and I was looking through there and I said, oh my lord, people probably think I'm the biggest bee with the itch because I just don't answer. So, I'm going to try to start doing better with that. I've been trying to keep on top of it. So, <laughs> I love y'all and I appreciate y'all. And, um, Merry Christmas to y'all. Happy holidays and all that good stuff. It's time to um, be with family and enjoy and and be happy. Try to be happy. So, anyway, I love y'all and I'll be seeing y'all real soon. Lots of love from Texas. Until next time. Talk to you real soon. Bye for now.